there is an altar in Zaria for those of you who do not know I belong enough in this city I have seen the spirits that govern this territory there are wicked spirits that sit upon this city one of the reasons why I came because I heard that kidnapping and terrorism and all this had started in Zaria I knew what had gone wrong it was the reason why I came I knew that there was something that had gone wrong in the spirit because the offering is not just for members it can also be for territories you think it's pride and carry your ignorance and keep moving there see we are too young to sit down and begin to debate about certain ancient kingdom mysteries while we do this we empower darkness over our lives I saw a vision in 2018 of a terrible destruction that came upon this city I saw people being killed like chickens I fasted dry for three days and said Lord it will not stand it will not stand why will God's people be shredded like chickens like Brothers and sisters, please hear me. I speak to you by the Spirit. The days and the times that we live in require exactitude of spiritual understanding. You will miss out on a key in the Spirit and it will empower darkness. Jesus in John 17 said all that you have given me I have kept and none is lost except the son of perdition he had to account for the souls connected to him Jesus before the father there are many of you there are times that I see dangerous things that are coming and you may not even know the Lord reveals them to me and I stand up by the spirit and I repeat. you just know that there was turbulence for a few days and then rest just that hood is 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 a covenant with wisdom you don't have to say everything I have seen many people here that whose families whose marriages whose destinies would have been shredded off by demons But the key is an understanding for as long as you sit down and allow yourself to be misled by nonsense you expose yourself please you don't have to come and be dropping money here if you don't know what you're doing but I am telling you this thing my life listen about a month ago my father was sick in a way that in my entire life as his first son I'd never seen my father sick like that and the next thing I returned from a meeting and then I get a call that my father said all his children should come but he saw that he was going immediately I had that I said this is not about your son you are my father in the flesh I know that you are my father in the flesh it's true you gave back to me in the flesh but stand back this is not your battle you know nothing about the clash of covenants listen to what I'm telling you I traveled down to going on here there was coffee and they stopped me there I said this nonsense called some military people and said get me out of this place and when I went there I looked at my father I said except this call does not have a throne from heaven that backs it my father had called all of us he said come together one week after I uncle in the village who had lived long he died like a chicken immediately listen I'm teaching you mysteries of the kingdom if you don't know this thing I promise you you will pay the price with your life and your destiny may be the reason behind the mysterious 
occurrences in our lives the first question is not what is happening to my destiny the first question is where is your prophetic connection where is your prophetic connection hear me listen don't just succeed know why you are succeeding don't just say I am favored know where it's coming from don't just say I am anointed know where it's coming from the day that your mind forgets he said let it not be when you have built houses and done this you say my power very costly destiny mistakes that people continue to make across the globe and they pay the price for foolishness and ignorance listen let me tell you this if you are a true son and a true daughter in this ministry there are graces that must speak in your life believe what I'm telling you the key word is true genuine by the spirit in the sincerity of your heart from the bowels of your spirit it says thou shall anoint Aaron and anoint his sons that I, as I was with him I will also be with his son. It's a covenant. Hallelujah. Listen to me. We're about to pray many people's destinies have been reduced to nothing there are people who have connected themselves with wisdom and began to rise with the wings of eagles in strange dimensions in the midst of the lockdown there are people who have experienced favor and liftings because this thing is by covenant by covenant There are people who are saying there is a casting down but there are others who are truly saying there is a lifting up we are going to pray and in one minute listen I like you to challenge the powers and the altars that want to see your destiny to destruction that in the name of Jesus I am aware of the name of the Lord Yeshua HaMashiach I am aware of the altar and the spiritual covenant the tribe that I am part of in the spirit pray Shibakatash Ambrakatakaporaposososobashia there are blessings that are upon this spiritual family there are 